Our hymn is number 232. to my assistance, Lord, may haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Alleluia. As sun declines and shadows fall, the sea and hills will fade from sight. Its fiery orb bids us farewell, but promises tomorrow's light. And this, O oh God, creator wise, you regulate in wondrous way the laws of this great universe at which we marvel night and day. While darkness rides across the sky, and stars their silent watches keep, your children leave their constant toil, regaining strength by peaceful sleep. Made rich in hope, kept strong in faith, may we be blessed throughout the night. By Christ the Word, who timeless reigns, true splendor of the Father's light. He is the sun that never sets, no dust can make his luster die. The kind protector of the earth, the joys of all the saints on high. O Father, Son, and Spirit blessed, grant us at last that light to see, and full of joy your praises sing, bathed in your love eternally. Amen. By this we know love, that he laid down his life for us. Alleluia, oh give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his love endures forever. Give thanks to the God of gods, for his love endures forever. Give thanks to the Lord of lords, for his love endures forever. Who alone has wrought marvelous works, for his love endures forever. Whose wisdom it was made the skies, for his love endures forever. Who fixed the earth firmly on the sea, for his love endures forever. It was he who made the great lights, for his love endures forever. The sun to rule in the day, for his love endures forever. The moon and the stars in the night, for his love endures forever. The firstborn of the Egyptians he smote, for his love endures forever. He brought Israel out from their midst. For his love endures forever. Arm outstretched with power in his hand. For his love endures forever. He divided the Red Sea in two. For his love endures forever. He made Israel pass through the midst. For his love endures forever. 
he flung back. Pharaoh and his force in the sea, for his love endures forever. Through the desert his people he led, for his love endures forever. Nations in their greatness he struck, for his love endures forever. Kings in their splendor he slew, for his love endures forever. Sion, king of the Amorites, for his love endures forever. And Enoch, the king of Bashan, for his love endures forever. He let Israel inherit their land, for his love endures forever. On his servant their land he bestowed, for his love endures forever. He remembered us in our distress, for his love endures forever. And he snatched us away from our foes, for his love endures forever. He gives food to all living things, for his love endures forever. To the God of heaven give thanks, for his love endures forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. By this we know, love, that he laid down his life for us. Blessed, blessed are you that weep now, for you shall not. Sharon was supposed to be here. By the rivers of Babylon, where we sat and wept remembering Zion, on the poplars that grew there we hung up our hearts. For it was there that they asked us, our captors for songs, our oppressors for joy. Sing to us, they said, one of Zion's songs. Oh, how could we sing the song of the Lord and name you so? If I forget you, Jerusalem, let my right hand wither. Oh, let my tongue cleave to my mouth if I remember you not. If I prize not Jerusalem above all my joy. Remember, O Lord, against the sons of Edom, the day of Jerusalem, when they said, Tear it down, tear it down to its foundation. O Babylon, destroy it. He is happy who repays you the ills you brought on us. He shall seize and shall dash your children on the rock. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Blessed are you that weep now, for you shall laugh. Psalm 71. HP 50. Rabbi, you are the Son of God, you are the King of Israel. O God, give your judgment to the King, to a King's Son, your justice, that he may judge your people in justice and your poor in right judgment. May the mountains bring forth peace for the people and the hills justice. May he defend the poor of the people, and save the children of the needy, and crush the oppressor. He shall endure like the sun and the moon, from age to age. He shall descend like rain on the meadow, like raindrops on the earth. In his days justice shall flourish, and be still the moon pale. He shall rule from sea to sea, 
from the great river to earth's lands. Before him his enemies shall fall, his foes lick the dust. The kings of Tarshish and the sea coasts shall pay him tribute. The kings of Sheba and Seba shall bring him gifts. Before him all kings shall fall prostrate, all nations shall serve him. For he shall save the poor when they cry, and the needy who are helpless. He will have pity on the weak and save the lives of the poor. From oppression he will rescue their lives. To him their blood is dear. Long may he live. May the gold of Sheba be given him. They shall pray for him without ceasing and bless him all the day. May corn be abundant in the land, to the peaks of the mountains. May its fruit rustle like Lebanon, may men flourish in the cities, like grass on the earth. May his name be blessed forever, and endure like the sun. Every tribe shall be blessed in him, all nations bless his name. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, who alone works wonders. Ever blessed his glorious name. Let his glory fill the earth. Amen. Amen. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come. Now and forever. Amen. Rabbi, you are the Son of God. You are the King of Israel. Page A68. Fifty-eight. All things we created through him and for him. Glory to God through the ages. Let us give thanks to the Father for having made you worthy to share the lot of the saints in life. He rescued us from the power of darkness and brought us into the kingdom of his beloved Son. Through him we have redemption, the forgiveness of our sins. He is the image of the invisible God, the firstborn of all creatures. In him everything in heaven and on earth was created, things visible and invisible. All were created through him, all were created for him. He is before all else that is. In him everything continues in me. It is he who is head of the body, the church. He who is the beginning, the firstborn of the dead. So that primacy may be his in everything. It pleased God to make absolute fullness reside in him. And by means of him, to reconcile everything in his person, both on earth and in the heavens, making peace through the blood of his cross. <clears throat> Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. All things we created through Him and for Him. Glory to God through the ages. From the first letter of Peter. 
in your relations with one another, clothe yourselves with humility, because God is stern with the arrogant, but to the humble he shows kindness. Bow humbly under God's mighty hand, so that in due time he may lift you high. Cast all your cares on him, because he cares for you. Stay sober and alert. Your opponent, the devil, is prowling like a roaring lion, looking for someone to devour. Resist him, solid in your faith, realizing that the brotherhood of believers is undergoing the same sufferings throughout the world. The God of all grace, who called you to his everlasting glory in Christ, will himself restore, confirm, strengthen, and establish those who have suffered a little while. Dominion be his throughout the ages. Amen. Mode 1, page D14. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior. For he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him. In every generation, he has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones, and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy. The promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. 
Claudia, come let us from the Pentecostes. Alleluia. Claudia, Spiritus Sanctus, in igne discipulis apparuit, et ribuit eis carismatum dona. Missi Deus in universum mundum, predicare et estificare, Qui credit et id et batizatus fuerit, salvus et id. Alleluia. Beloved brothers and sisters, let us rejoice in our God, for he takes great delight in bestowing benefits on his people. Let us fervently pray. Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison. Eternal God, for whom a thousand years are like the passing day, Help us to remember that life is like a flower which blossoms in the morning but withers in the evening. Give your people manna to satisfy their hunger and living water to quench their thirst for all eternity. Let your faithful ones seek and taste the things that are above, and let them direct their work and their leisure to your glory. Deliver us from all harm, Lord, and pour out your abundant blessings on our homes. Pray for Father John and Father Nathan, for all those who've asked for our prayers, for parishioners at all souls, for uh, Scott and for Kim. For our benefactors, for our families, for our friends, especially for Dr. Yaros, who received me today for free. For, for family and friends, especially those traveling on vacations this time of year. Show the faithful depart at the vision of your face. Let them rejoice in the contemplation of your presence. Kiyeleison. Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord God, holy is your name and renown your compassion, cherished by every generation. Hear our evening prayer, and let us sing your praise, and proclaim your greatness forever. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in the peace of Christ. Thanks be to God. May the divine assistance be always with us. And also with our brothers and sisters. Moderality of June the 13th. 
Memorial of St. Anthony, a Portuguese Franciscan who, on his return from a mission in the land of Islam, went to preach in Lombardy, Italy, and then in Limousin, France, where he founded the convent of Brie. Rich in scriptural citations, his sermons have merited him the title Evangelical Doctor. He died at Padua in 1231. Elsewhere, the heavenly birth of numerous other saints whose names are inscribed in the Book of Life. 